What's up everybody? It's Robert coming to you from the Old Bird Farm. Lots of updates out here at the Old Bird Farm. Like, we finally got a really good farm truck out here on the Old Bird Farm. I already texted Aaron about it. He's up on his healing walk up on the Appalachian Trail and he's actually super excited about this truck as well. He says that uh, now we can actually really haul stuff and uh, we can, but enough about the truck. I'll tell you guys a lot more about that later. Other than the fact that I traded like two cars for it. Never traded two for one before. We've got even more exciting stuff. Let me show you. Come on in. So here's the newest excitement on the old bird farm. One of the things that I'm the most excited about. You feel that? Here, just, just stick your hand up there and feel that for a minute. That's air conditioning. That's right, the air conditioner in the camper works, which I was told it was a new unit when I got this camper. But I mean, it's true, but that's a light on. Don't get too excited. It's just running off a generator right now. We still gotta get the power pole up and do all the power pole things to get power out here. But we have a generator that's big enough to run this camper and my goodness that is cold and we got lights on in here how cool is that all right that's enough of that we got to get back out in the heat and we got to do some work let's go back outside all right so back out in the heat and yeah it's hot out here this is what we're going to be working on today a little bit of this a little bit of that a little bit of this right here this whole little area needs to get the same treatment that this area got right here so we just need to keep pushing back and get all this cleaned up sorted put different places you know where it goes all that sort of thing so that being said if this loud guinea will be just a little bit more quiet for us we're gonna get to work so uh let's do it
All right, so that is a lot of old tin. I completely understand why it took me so long to get it off picked up in the first place. And right now I'm taking just a minute to try to sell some of it. Because if you didn't know, people buy, people buy this stuff. Well, especially people who like antiques. And uh, I got a lot of it. So I'm about to put it on Marketplace right now for $10 a sheet if you buy four or more sheets. Or $20 a piece per single sheet. You know, just to get it on out of here. Acceptable to, open to offers. Offers are acceptable too. Especially if you take every single piece of it. So let's, uh, let's put it online. And then pick up the rest of it. Okay, well, I've had just about enough picking up 10 today. So we've got to move on to our next task of an old bird farm favorite, mowing wisteria, because it's all growing back out here. Before we do that, let me show you this over here. It's pretty, got to show it to you. So that just popped up the other day. Um, I'm guessing this is more from the wildflower mound that must have just washed down here. It's a really pretty flower. I have no idea what it is, so you know the drill. If you know what it is, please comment down below and let me know. I've also got a bunch of this other little yellow flower that I showed you before 
blooming all over the field. So uh, let me show you that one too. But this is pretty, real pretty. Lots and lots of this. Whatever it is. Actually, that's not the same thing. These are different too. This is new. Because this is what I showed you before. See the difference there? So let me know what that is down in the comments. And you guys already let me know what that was. But let me know what that is. Looks kind of, maybe they are the same thing. Because that one's kind of similar. But no, I don't know. Let me know. Let me know down in the comments. Yeah, I think they are the same thing because the, the stem looks the same. That was just a kind of different one. And then we got one of these again. That popped up and down here where it's getting a little bit more snaky. We got some more. So the wildflowers definitely washed down and are just blooming all over the place, which is really really nice so i'm gonna mow around them definitely don't want to mow down our wildflowers and then we'll just go over here and just cut everything over there because it's all just wisteria so let's do it That's a wrap, folks, for today anyway. I'll see you on the next one.